to give it a good yank before I showed you. I didn't really oof down on that. Uh, then what we're going to do, again, more realism. Did I do it to this? I did it slightly to this one. But we want this kind of a thing. We don't have to get too deep. Again, it is underneath. But if you, from the side or from the front, you might be able to see something happening. Yeah. And I also want to get, like I said, a shadow. And it's going to go in. As I do with a lot of my hand in shirt, coat, cuff. And I have it go in. Now here's the thing that I was saying. There's something different about this. Oops, careful. We're going to futz with the thumb. We want to give some kind of a thumb and we'll come back to the spoon in a bit. Thumb is still on the uh, inside. I'll be needing a chisel. To, or do I? Well, I need it. No, I don't. But it's in the wrong direction. But <sighs> something that gives a hint that that is a, <sighs> a thumb of some kind. Now the sleeve, remember we do when it went in this way? Well, what we're going to do, straight down. And this time the sleeve is going to go in this way because it's a rolled up sleeve or rolled back sleeve. All right. All right, now we're... Now we're going. The spoon, I'm debating on playing with it some more, but almost leaving it at the end. I can I can still do some digging here. I just hate, to, even though there's still a lot of wooden handle, I'm a little leery. about grabbing hold of it and snapping it and so let's see if we can just get it started so when it comes to cleaning up we just do a little bit of detail and or not detail a little bit of something but at least we get most of the lumber out of there be that much less to play with that's not too shabby for a first start now you'll notice this is going to be the fun part do you see the how the sleeve or the uh, arm comes up this way because of the spoon the router bit could not get in there so we want at the very least come up to the shoulder watch the beard is to at least look as if and we'll come back later comparing this is the same as this and what's going to happen is we're going to get our V tool in there and hopefully show the arm separated from the rest of the body. I 
chisel type. And again, while we're here, other than, well, other than cleaning up a bit, we'll come back later when it comes to picking and little, little tiny shavings, but a little, maybe a little bit of the spoon. Oh, am I out of picture here? You know, I think the problem is, is I'm on this chair that's got these these uh, easy wheels that just all of a sudden I'm just, you know, ooh, and I'm traveling up here close to the front door and have a whole carving done before I realize it. Okay, like what we did back here, we're going to do here before we leave this arm. And just a little bit of extra here. Now this, I want this to really be more sharper and deeper. Now sometimes I could add a little bit of rounder to it. Make sure it's a little round, it's deep but round. Is a second one. Maybe not as deep, maybe not as long. Set back, there we go, hand, right hand, spoon, arm. Caught up, Can you, catching your breath. <laughs> All right, let's get to the hand, other hand, that'd be left hand, hand and bowl. Now the thing is, is I did, I did good. Start again. Start with taking the hand away from the sleeve. We close enough, far enough. Hello. There we go. Hello. There you go. <sighs> like I said, this the hand goes in the sleeve, even the thumb will be in the sleeve and come out. And I need to figure out how to do this. Adjust myself so you can watch this. As I mentioned before, in another video, somebody uh, said, well, why don't you look through your visor or your while doing this and I can't do that see if, if, if I look there's I'm 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 videoing with the my s10 phone s9 phone pardon me and it still has a delay I come down there's still about a probably a sixteenth of an inch or sixteenth of a second delay and it's enough to screw me up so I'm just gonna have to kind of keep one eye on the camera and one eye on the wood because I definitely want to keep my eye on the wood I don't want to cut myself okay now we're going to shape the hand that's a good chip that came out of there remembering that thumb but the thumb does go in the sleeve but comes out
Then I'm going to do one like this. Start straightening it out. But he's around, well, he's around the bowl. His hand is around the bowl, but the bowl goes in. I'll just take a little bit off here. And I, what I want to do is I want to shape the hand first. And then I'm, the bowl, but keeping the bowl in mind. So remember, thumb. Now the thing is, is I have given more thumb here. Uh, the thumb it does is not does not extend. I, I've given more thumb, and the thumb is going to go in the bowl. So that's going to go away. But before I do, I want to get my bearings here. And then, now remember we do it the. Four fingers. We're gonna put their center line now. We when we do this, I'll put the, I'll just I'll just put these in for now just to get a feel. Now what's going to happen here is this is way going to go under the bowl. It will separate. We can fingers do separate at the base. Goes under the bowl, but I don't want to separate too much because this. The ring finger will start to come under the bowl too. While the middle finger and the ring finger and the uh, index finger will kind of hold the top of the bowl. There's the index, or the pinky, the ring. Come on. The middle but it looks like we got more on these fingers but then that's because I got more to separate these two will be together these two can be together and a thumb like I said the thumb is going to be like in, in inside the bowl so here we go chisel B tool I mean now, I can go deep here, but I want to be careful when I get up here because I still want to keep that bowl pretty thick. Give you a little more thumb than you needed. But we'll still make sure that we have the understanding that the thumb goes in the bowl. All right. Now this. But it's going to come in. It's going to do something like this. There we go. But yeah, we'll straighten that out as we go. Now, since we're relatively committed, so relatively, we can start bringing the bowl in now. I think this could be the thickest. This will be the thickest part of the bowl, and now we can start bringing it in. get that deep enough that I can keep doing this oh, careful the grain I think that's looking pretty darn good or decent rather now I'll bring the start bringing the bowl up So we can bring the pinky down. All right. 
right, now comes the fun part. Now I'm gonna separate these two, these two first. This one, like I said, I do the 10%. I think I did, I twisted my, my wrist for the other 10%. Now this is gonna go down. So there is gonna be some bowl showing. I'm gonna put some inf to it. Now again, be careful about prying because you don't want to lift that finger up. There we go. Some more separating here. Start with that, and I think we can bring a little more down here. There we go. Quite a bit of get in there, be careful we don't there we go. And you can bring the wood up with your knife, but And the pinky does go back a little farther than the, even though it's shorter, but it goes farther back in the hand. It's a little smaller. It's the smaller the fingers. <coughs> oh, excuse me on that. Get dry dry throat here now the bowl is kind of rounding down so the hand rounds this way too so we're gonna some double rounding here all right a little bit of rounding here I'm bringing down. There. So I need to shorten a little bit more because well, it's the second longest finger. Whereas this thing, this the index finger needs a little more shortening. We we'll hope we didn't get into the kettle too much there. Bowl.
There we go. Now I want to raise either that. Let's figure out where that where that bowl is here. Actually, cleaning and leveling at the same time. Or I'm going to straighten out the front here a little bit. Chisel, just try to do that. Pretty, pretty level there. that out of there. Now the thumb has to go in. There's still quite a bit more. Brush going here. What's left that needs to be fixed? And here. Well, this is why we're at it. Do this. We're cleaning this area up at the same time. <laughs> 